Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm Bradley Overrated, and today I'm bringing you another Overrated review, and today I'm talking about the Oregon Trail. That's right, that good old classic PC game from way back in the day, and is now in the Video Game Hall of Fame. So let's go ahead now and talk about this game. And the Oregon Trail is in fact a game that is targeted for children. It's meant to discuss them and teach them about the Oregon Trail and the historical context within it. The beauty of this game though is despite it the fact that it's targeted towards children, I think it's rather enjoyable as an adult. I still enjoy this game. It's so fun to type a bunch of your friends in there, go out on this trail, and see which one of them dies. Will they die of dysentery? Will they break their legs, break their arms, drown in a river? All of these things you don't know, but that's what makes it so fun. And it is, in fact, like I said, an educational game. You will need to use reading comprehension critical thinking, and mathematics if you are to survive the treacherous path that is the Oregon Trail as it traverses the entirety of the United States of America. And it's simple in the way it presents this game. It's basically a text-based adventure. You have a variety of options. You can choose whether or not you want to buy certain supplies, if you want to go hunting, if you want to collect more food, if you want to try to trade with people, gather information. You can even look at a map. All the stuff you get to choose, and then you basically, the game just kind of goes on autopilot, and you see what events unfold. It gives you options, it gives you choices, and every single playthrough that you go through is going to be unique and different and hopefully you won't drown in the stupid rivers because that tends to happen a lot with me i've discovered i think the most impressive thing about the oregon trail is the fact that it actually does deliver a sense of you're getting an education while still having a good time i now know where the oregon trail begins where it ends i know the fort names I, you can even actually, fun fact, you can actually pull up a bunch of information at the start screen and learn even more about the Oregon Trail if you want. So it is a very well done and thought out educational game. As a matter of fact, the only thing I can say that could even go as a negative criticism for this game is the hunting side mini game that you can do where you can hunt and try to gather more food for your band of merry gentlemen or gentlewoman or gentle people. I don't really care for the hunting game. It's a little bit hard to f control. It's not very engaging. That's about the only critique I have because everything else in this game is just so fun and addicting and I enjoy this game immensely. And what's even better about this game now is that it's entirely free. All you gotta do is do a little bit of searching online and you can play this game at any time as long as you own a PC. So you don't even have to pay to play, which to me is perfect because this, this is just nostalgia at its finest, man. The Oregon Trail is an excellent game. It is great for children and adults alike. It's a lot of fun. If you have kids, I highly recommend you introduce them to this game. I think they'll really enjoy it. It's just a good time. Which is why I'm going to give the Oregon Trail for PC this wonderful, wonderful game a solid A minus and i was gonna give it an a i really wanted to give it an a but like i said the hunting mechanic i didn't really care for it there's a the few really minor things too in the game that i felt like could have been maybe just a little bit better not going into all those details but the bottom line is if you like the oregon trail if you like educational games if you want to introduce your kids to a really fun game where they can learn and have a good time at the same time then you don't have to look any further. This game is great. And this, my friends, concludes my overrated review. I hope you enjoyed it. And please, please try not to die of dysentery. I am Bradley Overrated, out like a trout. And I'll see you next time.